guys, this is Antoine Goodwin with CNET.com on the floor at the 2013 Geneva Motor Show and we're taking a look at the car that I want to drive the most today. It's the Toyota iRoad Concept. Now this little electric vehicle is about the size of your average motorcycle. There's actually space in this vehicle for two despite it being so narrow and that's because you use a tandem seating cell. The driver sits up front and one passenger can fit behind them, sort of like you would on a motorcycle. Now each of those front wheels is powered by a two kilowatt electric motor that gets its energy from a lithium ion battery pack inside the body of the vehicle. The interesting thing about this is that unlike most vehicles that you drive on the road today and most motorcycles, it actually does its steering with the rear wheel. So when you turn the yolk that's in the uh, front of the driver's seat, the rear wheel kind of counter steers to kind of scoot your body around. Now on a normal vehicle that's this narrow, that could be a little scary and you could find yourself flipping over, but the iRoad actually has a system called Active Camber and that uses little motors that are in the front suspension to sort of tilt the vehicle into the turn like you would on a motorcycle when you see a race driver sort of drop in a knee. That gives you that extra grip in the turn uh, when you're cornering really hard. Now we've been watching the uh, demonstrators here just kind of whipping around and like very, very tight circles. That sort of rear wheel steering plus active camber gives this car an extremely small turning radius that's great for in the city when you need to do things like squeeze into tiny parking spots and flip quick U-turns. Now the Toyota iRoad concept is just that, just a concept. There are no actual plans to build this vehicle and sell it just yet. But I'll tell you what, it is, as I said, the vehicle that I want to drive the most on the floor at the Geneva Motor Show today. I've been Antoine Goodwin with CNET.com and we've been taking a look at the Toyota iRoad concept.